are very much looking forward to four days on the Naysmar at York with some beautiful weather. Queen's Trust at one of yours, Sir Michael, is a leading player. Yes, she would be. Um, she had been unlucky in her two previous starts and ran a blinder in the Nassau. She, we know she gets a mile and a half um, on that Ribblesdale run. I don't know who's going to turn up, but I'm, I would be hopeful. I thought for a while she was probably going to uh, shake up minding at Goodwood. Yeah, I wasn't that optimistic, but it, it was a very pleasing effort. What about across the stars? Because he's a horse I know you liked. Kieran was always pleased with him and liked him before the derby. Good to see him back on track at Royal Ascot. Yes, yeah, I've always liked him. Uh, he continues to improve. I hate running them with a penalty, mm. but sometimes you just have to because it slots into the program. I wanted to really back off him after the uh, King Edward because he had those two quick races. So, look, he goes over the chance, but they're vulnerable with penalties in those races. Ultimately, is the aim very much the St. Ledger with him? No, I, I, I said after the King Edward, I didn't think he was a Ledger horse. I'm still not sure he's a Ledger horse, but we did put him in. York may tell us a little bit more. We'll decide after that. Mm, all in all, big chances and a fun week in store. You can watch it all live on 888 Sport. Have we got to? <laughs>